the ongoing fuel shortage in parts of the country has been attributed to disagreement over import costs between oil marketing companies and the franchised retailers they sell their product to. According to a source of the Ministry of Energy that spoke to Citizen TV, the oil marketing companies are only supplying fuel stations that they own on the premise that they will incur losses should they sell to other retailers. This standoff has created yet another artificial shortage in the country, with some parts of the country reporting little to no fuel at the pumps, including areas like Kisi, Eldoret, Busia and some parts of Nairobi. Our source further revealed to us that the Energy and Petroleum Regulatory Authority has taken up the matter since they are charged with setting prices in the country and have asked the oil marketing companies to explain the increased import cost that they are alleging was not Heard. Meanwhile, non-franchise dealers in the country are saying that they are not protected by the regulator from oil marketing companies. This standoff comes just a fortnight after the Ministry of Energy reprimanded oil marketing companies for hoarding fuel, which resulted in the deportation of Ruba CEO Jean-Christian Bagaron and the questioning of over 10 executives at the DCI over possible charges of economic sabotage.